So here we have the Kia Pro Seed on a 16 plate. I'm going to start off by showing you inside the boot and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside from there. As we approach the back of the car, you can see we have reversing sensors, plenty of boot space as well, along with that 60-40 split folding rear seat, should you wish to increase this space even further. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. On the left-hand side, we have the rev counter, we have the speedometer in the middle, and the fuel gauge over on the right-hand side. Also in the middle, you can see the total miles for this car, which are 14,709. We then have the trip computer above that. If we back out to the steering wheel, uh, on the left-hand side, we have stereo and phone controls. And on the right-hand side, uh, we have the button that will change the menu information, just there. Uh, and also we have cruise control for the car, as well as speed limiter. Over on this side, you can put the car into its GT mode, which will affect uh, the volume of the exhaust, for example. Uh, you might just better hear it. Possibly not, but through the phone. But yeah, uh, you can turn that on and off very easily through that button just there. Over in this center, we then have the touchscreen for the car. So we have the main volume on the left-hand side just here. Uh, we have the radio button. We're on the radio menu at the moment. So you'll see that this car has got DAB, FM, and AM radio available to you. If you want to listen to your own music, you can do. Just press that media button just there. Uh, and then you're on the media menu. Uh, and you can see you have a few different ways of connecting up and listening to devices. So you have Bluetooth audio, auxiliary input, USB input. Uh, just there as well so loads of ways to listen to your music in this car if I pop the vehicle into reverse you'll see that we have a full color reversing camera as well as the parking sensors which you can hear as well uh, we've also got satellite navigation which is accessed just here there's a full video showing how that works on our website and on our YouTube channel as well below that we then have the dual zone climate control. So you can adjust the driver and passenger temperatures independently. You can increase and decrease the fan speed, determine what direction you'd like the air to be distributed in down here. And then that button will turn your air conditioning on and off again. Below that, we have the auxiliary and USB inputs. You can plug your music devices into these. We also have two 12 volt charging sockets as well. We can turn our parking sensors off from here and we have a six speed manual gearbox. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car in person and have a test drive, please feel free to call any of our MJA sites. We'd love to hear from you soon.